Okie dokie. Testing one, two, three. Hopefully I'm playing. And before I actually start anything, I'll give you guys a moment to arrive. Since this is kind of maybe a surprise, since it's a little bit of an off time, but eh, I'm thinking as long as we get some game time in, we're good. We're good. Pardon me as I casually sip my water. Delicious water. I'm also making sure that social media has um, all the things that need to be posted. So, give me a moment. Close something down, open something up. Hopefully we get what we're looking for, and hopefully we're getting the game. Kids playing outside. Fantastic. Come on. Ah, there we go. Sorry, I'm just totally 20th century foxing over all these other involved companies. Also, hello, the Doctor 4554. Press any key. Why doesn't the mouse count? Eh? Is that Jupiter? It looks like Jupiter. Possibly isn't knowing the crazy vastness of the alien verse. Ah, hey, high-pitched, whistly noises of horror that we usually typically hear in a lot of media. How you doing? Ooh. You don't hear a lot of emptiness a sound like this. Oh. Here comes the menu music again. Never mind. Also, hello, Autumn. Autumn Breathe. How you doing? I'm thinking we're gonna go a little bit blind with this game and... See what happens. Now, is this like a survival horror where you have to run and hide? Or can you kind of shoot the aliens? I mean, I don't know. Because I have seen no nothing of this game. Therefore, I am going in completely blind. So, I don't know what to expect. I expect horror because that's kind of typical and it's kind of required for this series. So, enough talking, let's play the game. Oh, I should probably introduce myself since that's a normal thing to do in these kind of things. I'm Jesterday Rama. Good day and welcome, buddies. I gotta work on those intros, I gotta, gotta do those better. I am. In regards to your question, I do prefer to stream with people I do know first, so I can have a good idea of how things will work. So I kind of need to get to know you first before I stream with you. It's just kind of a personal thing. Because I want to know someone a little bit personally. Lily. Lily. Oh, there's challenges in survivor mode. Let's just play the actual game so we can get the story in this segment. Continue game? What game I have even played? Oh. The recommended way to experience the game. Challenging and terrifying. Okay. Nightmare, the ultimate test of survival. I don't think I'm going to do Nightmare yet. Still a challenge, but one you may survive. For increased chance of survival. Dot, dot, dot. A thrilling experience. The greatest chance of survival. Um. I'm not sure if I should do medium or hard, because I have never played this. I'm not sure if I want to get angry at a horror game like this. That I'm not sure if that's appropriate. I mean, Five Nights at Freddy's, I'll rage at that, yeah. 
Wow, stuck in a menu, stuck in difficulties. Um, I'll go medium for now. I can barely even see that to begin with. It just the slider until the Siegson logo is barely visible against the black background. It's a little radio sound. Hmm, I can kind of cheat a little bit. And just to make things a little bit easier for the stream, I'll try and bump it up a little bit. But hopefully this should be enough. EMP devices can be used to disable androids for a short amount of time. Oh, do I have to go against androids? Fantastic. I do try to be moderately active on my Twitch, or sorry, not Twitch, my Discord though, so if you can see the link down here at the bottom Final of the stream, of the commercial starship Nostromo. that's my link to my Discord officer reporting. server. The other members of the crew, Kane, Ripley, Lambert, Parker, Brett. Ash and Captain Dallas. Captain Dallas. Cargo and ship destroyed. I should Typical. reach the frontier in about six weeks. With a little luck, the network will pick me up. Oh, look at those pixels. This is Ripley. Last survivor of the Nostromo. Signing off. Oh boy. Hello, Rhythm. Ripley? I'm Samuels. I work for the company. It's about your mother. We think we may have found her, Amanda. Uh, uh, face animation. Sorry. A commercial vessel, the Anisadora, has recovered what we believe to be the flight recorder unit of the Nostromo. Where? Zeta Reticula. What did it tell you? We don't know. The unit was taken to Sevastopol Station. It's proprietorial material, so the company wants it to be collected as soon as possible. Hmm, nice sound design. Sevastopol's a supply depot in the region. It's a, a permanent freeport. I facility. know what it is. Transit's arranged. There's a courier ship called the Torrens heading out that way in two days. A little bit of frame lag, but that's probably travel out. We oui. probably Me and another exec because and you are willing. OBS, open broadcasting software. Look, Ripley. When this job came across my desk, I read the case history. The most recent alien mo movie I saw I was Prome Prometheus. Was working in the region where she went missing. You're still looking, aren't you? I've been cleared to offer you a place on the Torrents if you want to come along. Maybe there'll be some closure for you. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, closure, sure. That's always a nice term to use in a horror movie. Totally not foreshadowing anything. Oh, now I have like perfect frames. Like, what the heck? So, those cutscenes are apparently more graphic intensive. Let's see. Hmm. Pardon me. I kind of had a cuticle issue. Wow, this kind of looks a little bit archaic for a futuristic freaking civilization. I mean, look how pixelated that is. That's, that's like freaking low freaking pixelation. Pixelation. Jeez, like your frickin' font size, my lord. Objective, get dressed. Oh. That's cool. No, n what? No dresser here? What the freak? Personal storage. Do I do anything with this? I have no idea where to go. There is no waypoint, which is nice. No hand holding, but seriously, I need to get dressed. Oh, there we go. I walked right to it. Perfect. Does it glow from a distance? Oh. No, it didn't point it out. Good. Yeah. Got dressed. It's like we're still in the eighties with how pixelated this font is. Use registration. I should have read. Use registration points to probably save or something. Okay, do I just... What the free? Oh. Yep. <laughs> it looks like a freaking old payphone, my god. We are in the 80s. Don't overwrite your current save data? Yes. A lot of saving for what would be in a pretty fast PC. Am I okay to move? Um, I would hope that was a fast save because there was no inclination implication of what to do otherwise. So I'm Amanda Ripley, the daughter of Mother Ripley. Where do I go from here? Seriously, where do I go? Uh, down the dark hallway? Sure. Why not? Oh, hey, there's somebody here. For Taylor. now. Good morning. Ripley, it's certainly not good. I very much doubt it's morning either. Sorry. I feel like death. I don't know how you people put up with hypersleep regularly. You get used to it. I don't do long haul very often. Most legal execs don't travel further than the coffee machine. I'm surprised Wayland Yutani felt the need to send legal at all. The loss of the Nostromo and its cargo cost the company a lot of money. It's important we find out what happened. If I can close the case with a conclusive accident report, it'll look great with my superiors. I'm sorry. That was insensitive. Realize your mother has been missing for 15 years and, and you oh it's okay we'll both get what we want right uh, 
Have you seen Samuels? He's probably been up for hours. I'll catch up with him. Oh, I didn't even know that was my task. I'm just randomly going places and lucking out. <laughs> A record of disaster. Personal. The Stromo incident. Ooh, a little bit of story. To N. Taylor. Reply, Nostromo incident. Wayland, Utani, file, number, blah, blah, blah. Hey, Taylor, I got your case request. It may take a while to dig out the files and the incident before... And the, and the incident happened before my time at the company, so I'm a bit fuzzy on the details. In 2122, the Wayland Utani cargo vessel, the USCSS Nostromo, went missing. No traces found of its cargo or crew. Apart from a new science officer, the rest of the crew had worked together before, seven in all. Dallas, Captain Ash, science officer, Kane, or is it Kane? Executive officer, Ripley, warrant officer, navigation officer, Lambert. Um, oh, wow, it actually treats the keyboard like a keyboard. Torrens manifest. What's that supposed to mean? Oh, wait a second. Okay, that was only one thing each. Alrighty, Torrens manifest. Name MSV seven seven six zero Torrens. M class starship. Captain Verlaine Diane. Navigator slash com officer. Connor William, owner Verlaine Diane, contractor Wayland Dutani, outbound and return transportation for Wayland Dutani retrieval team to Sevast Sevastopol Station. Team consists of three WI employees Samuels C, Ripley A, Taylor N. Passengers Samuels, Christopher, Ripley, Amanda, Taylor, Nina. Number of decks, two. Number of crew, two. Fantastico. So now I have to do something else. Oh, I never did get a chance to talk with Dr. Wolf. Sorry. <laughs> Okay, what's a bonding agent for? I don't know. Well, I'll probably just take these all just in case. Find blueprints to help you craft items from the components you collect. Oh, great. It's a different form of survival. It's a crafting survival. Where does this one go? Oh, dead end. Uh, I want to hold shift so I can run. Oh, I can use the radio. That's what space sounds like. Yeah, this is pretty retro for uh, over, over 100 years later. Eh, I'll leave it on just because. I can still hear it. It sounds like mangle. What does this button do? Nothing, apparently. Can I jump? No, I can't even jump yet. Well, I guess this might be a moderately accurate depiction of if we are actually this advanced in 100 years. Eh, going to this place because I think this is the only way. Ah, Ripley. Samuels, did you wake up early? Well, I don't really need as much sleep as the rest of you. 
I was just inspecting the Torrens facilities. Your lip sync is off. Ship. I realize it's a very similar model to the Nostromo. Yes, M class. A later pattern, but close in spec. I've worked engineering jobs on ships like this. Of course. Is Taylor up yet? She's not a seasoned traveler. Hypersleep may have been punishing for her. We talked. She seems nervous. Hmm. I hadn't noticed. She's a skilled executive, though. Should help us with any legal issues we might encounter. Right. Your face looks so lifeless. Looks like we're up. Why does your face look so lifeless? Objective. Okay. Cool. That's the map. I get a map. This is going to be also some navigational survival. He's an android, you say, uh, doc there, doctor? That's gonna seem a little robotic. Had a restful journey? The Torrens is in very good order for an old M-Class captain. She was a wreck when I bought her. Took a few years and a lot of contracts to refill. Yeah, 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 yeah. You said we're approaching Sevastopol Station. Are we docking? I believe your contact is Marshal Waits, is that right? I'll hail Sevastopol and arrange boarding with him. Good. Let's get this done. Don't worry, Miss Taylor. Routine. In and out. Connor, how are we doing? SMG loaded and calibrated. Approach vector locked. Prep con so I can say hello. Channel open, Captain. Does everyone have their briefing documents? You can watch the approach on the monitors. Collect your briefing fire. Okie dokie. Dramatic cutscene. Can we see it? Switch to monitors. Sevastopol Station. Is that damage? It looks like damage. Punch up 74, tight angle. Looks like the dry dock bay is screwed. I can't bring the Torrens into that. This is a commercial vessel, Torrens out of St. Clair, registration number MSV7760, calling Sevastopol traffic control. We're carrying three passengers on a whale and Utani Bond. You're holding the Nostromo flight recorder unit. We request immediate permission to transfer the passengers port side over. <laughs> Marshal, this is the Torrens. Say again. He said lockdown. The station's comms seem pretty screwed up, so I fitted Samuel's suit with a radio booster. I can only keep the Torrens in transit for 24 hours. You'll have heard from us by then. Safe trip. Don't die. Stand by. My contract doesn't cover bloody spacewalks. It's the only option. And it's perfectly safe if you do what I tell you. Depressurizing. Oh, fuck. Hating this. Just shadow me, Taylor. You too, Samuels. Affirmative. He said lockdown, you didn't hear it? Okay, let's go in. Fuck. Bright idea. My god, Ripley. You're doing good, Taylor. Well. Just keep moving. 
this will be a very fast. Die. Samuel! Taylor! Respond! Anybody! Okay. Well, the game is called Isolation for a reason. So I guess this is kind of where it starts. Kind of quick there, don't you think? The alien is not the only threat on board the station. The alien has heightened senses. It will spot you quicker than humans or androids. Now, so I also have to worry about humans. Yeah, let's save on the cassette. Wow, this view is really kind of limiting. Well, I know heads-up display. I mean, seriously, I'm like freaking Samus now. Hmm. I don't need to change my suit quite yet. I guess. Oh, so I change out of it and just uh, be normal. Got it. Well, as normal as normal gets in this kind of environment. Use registration points to manage your save your progress. They will warn you if enemies are nearby. Oh, great. Not to worry about them even being by save points. Yep. We're good. Oh, now I can run. Can I jump? No, I still can't jump. What kind of game doesn't allow you to jump? Oh. Mm-hmm. Glorious, just flamboyantly glorious, I swear. Can I crouch? Is it Alt? Is it C? Oh, it's C. Oh. Well, that was quick. Ooh, spooky, isn't it? So they try and lure you in with some atmosphere. Emphasis on the fear. Hehehe. <laughs> That's another thing. I'm also going in blind with the controls. Excuse me, I had to itch my neck. Because sometimes I get itchy too. And I gotta scratch that itch, dang it. Oh great, folder corrupted. That can't mean anything bad. No! Two, engineering team. Reply, decommission. So, boys and girls, you've probably heard the whispers about Sev Sevastopol. Uh, by now, and I can confirm it's official. Sevastopol is being decommissioned. I will go over with each of you what this means in regards to your contracts and next placement. But for now, we still have a job to do. The suits want this done with the skeleton crew, which means we'll only be getting a few outside contractors to help. But it doesn't mean oh that it does mean overtime. 
I recommend taking what you can while it's available. I should point out that the decommission does not mean lucky dip. Everything here has to be accounted for, and I will personally escort anyone found helping themselves to equipment to Marshall Waits, Chief. Let's go back and find out that we don't have anything else to read. Well, that's kind of a short little tidbit. Holy moly! Am I going to sustain an injury that stays continuous? Oh hey, knocked out some of my health. Well, I guess... God damn. That's what happens. This will help. Press Q to open the radial inventory. Use mouse to select. Jeez, I still feel like this is 80s gone modern with this friggin' interface now, doing this kind of stuff to me. Let's crouch through the cargo bay. Well, I guess we'll have to find a different way. Unless I can actually move these. Oh, good thing I did take all the things in that one ship because, well, I got separated pretty quickly. And I'm thinking that's what I should expect from more of these action survival horror games. I keep giving you different forms of survival horror. Don't... Oh, what's the term to use for the question? Oops. Um... Oh, that's me just standing still. Uh, what was the thing I had to do? I totally forgot the control. Um. Frick! What do I do? This is a long-lasting flare. Oh. Oh, really? Oh, it finally burned out. On sometimes on rare occasions, the AI of the bad guys will make them completely ignore them. Uh, it's not gameplay, it's just bugs in the game, just don't rely on it happening too often. Just thought I'd let you know for when it happens. Okay, thanks for the little heads up. I can't do anything here. Is there that I can do? Oh, Q, there it was. Q was the menu. Yeah, I'm doing great. 
Okay, here we go. Keep moving. Sure. Come on, Amanda. Amanda, please. Oh, you get radio. You get some fancy radio. I see how it is. So when can I craft things? Hello? Anyone here? <laughs> Say that so quietly. It's like you don't want to be heard. Thought I saw something. Trust no one. Um. Good God, freaking suitcase. Keep out. Um, I can't quite read that fully. Tomorrow. Tomorrow, no. To come out together equals no future. This life for. The ripped. I, I hear something, but I don't see it. Let's save the game first. It's a nice touch because you're saving your game. Makes it a challenge, I guess. Oh. Why didn't it work? Sevastolink. Sevastopol. Moved our stash. Langley, if you're looking for our stash, I've moved it. You left it right out in the open where anyone could have taken it. Jesus. Do you know what I had to do to get it? I've hidden it in one of the storerooms. You should be able to find it. The code is 0340. Don't worry, no one goes down to the terminal anymore. Not after what happened. Also, we're out of meds and low on water, so you're going to need to get some. It's your turn. Maybe it'll teach you to take care of our stuff in the future. Anna. <coughs> Excuse me. The voice kind of wore a little bit on me. Zero three four zero. Got to remember that. Hopefully. Oop! No! No! Too far! Too freaking far! Okie dokie. Goodbye from Seagson. Public notice: the decommissioning of Sevastopol Station. We've had a long journey together, but sadly, it's coming to an end. Seagson Corp would like to take this opportunity to thank all of you who worked and lived at Sevastopol over the years, and hopes that Seekson has helped to make it a productive and rewarding environment. Our investment and belief in the station has never wavered. Be assured that Seekson's Apollo Central AI and Working Joe androids will be there to serve Sevastopol until the last rivet is removed. We wish you all the very best for the future. After all, Sevastopol isn't just a station, it's people. Sixth and Corp. That just sounded so freaking cheesy. Kill the power. Harris, Turner, get back here now. We have a track. Somewhere in engineering. Lock the terminal down. Kill the power. And don't forget your reports. Make them thorough. We're going to need our paperwork to be bulletproof when this shit is over. Waits out. Oh, great. Oh, I can play it. 
somewhere in engineering. Lock the terminal down, kill the power, and don't forget your reports. Make them thorough. We're gonna need our paperwork to be bulletproof when this shit's over. Wait's up. Welly well well. Power Junction D13 Departures. Restore power to departures. Wow, it's so simple. Oh, hey! Let's get out of here. I'm going, I'm going. Wait! Let me follow you! Oh, somehow you are behind a locked door. Shoot! Not like I wanted to get out of here, too. Let's see what's behind this drawer thingy. This little cabinet. Oh, I got a flare. Forgotten if you... Frank Underwood? I know that guy. He's the president. In House of Cards. Or is he? My ceiling just creaked. That's bad timing. The frick? I'm actually hearing things. Oh, season 5 is out. It just came out on the 30th of May. Oh, crap! You really? Frickin' really? You run into that frickin' wire? Thanks, Ripley. Now I'm down to half health. Tomorrow, blah, 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 blah. Uh, left to right. Right. Yes, it was very shocking. I dare what say happened here? revolting. Well, I don't know. I think there was a mass evacuation or a mass massacre. I don't know. But look at all this graffiti. That meant they couldn't leave. Strangers will be shot. Oh. Great. The toilets. What? I'm right here. We're lame. No. Oh god, I'm screwed. They'll never find me. I'll be dead or something. Yeah, thanks for the creepy music for shutters. That door's freaking green. Let me get to it. Let me get past this invisible wall. Good god. This is an invisible wall because there's a freaking gap here. Yeah, there's a freaking gap. This is a bull crap invisible wall. I can get right through this freaking area. But I probably don't want to because it looks like it'll probably fall apart. Never mind my willingness to go through a freaking invisible wall. A thing. Hey, a flare. Double flare. Does that make me a flareon? <laughs> oh, well, I pressed E even, said R to act even though it said R to activate. 
One of these are gonna break, I swear. Hey, is that an arcade machine? This is an arcade. Nice. Wow, you move quick. That's weird looking for a bonding agent. Let us... Let me see what's going on in Sevastolink. Personal. Pulling the plug. Zoe, I'm sorry, but I won't need you to come in next week. As you know, the store's been in trouble for some time now, and I couldn't afford to hold off the credit creditors any longer. There's just no one coming to Sevastopol anymore. It's not just us either. It sounds like the whole station is in the red and they're pulling the plug, going to sell it off for scrap, I guess. I was speaking to one of the engineers and he reckons they'll announce it soon. I'm telling you, this is so you don't stick around looking for another job. Sevastopol's finished, time to move on, Harper. Oh, I d ooh. You freaking weird interface thing. It's like I have to freaking back out to see the other messages sometimes. No, oh, here we go. Two messages. To all space flight employees. To all space flight. Sp space flight terminal employers. Employees. In the interest of public safety and the prevention of panic, it must be made clear to all potential passengers that there are currently no scheduled flights leaving Sevastopol, nor ships available. The Colonel Marshals are investigating problems on station and will update accordingly. From the Office of Marshal Waits. Oh, that's nice. What is Apollo? Apollo is the central AI that monitors and provides guidance for all Sikhs and working Joes on Sevastopol. Apollo also oversees all communications on the station, so wherever you are, you know you're in safe hands. Sigson, tomorrow, together. Yeah, right. So let us just paranoidly save. Oh, good God, where is the freaking stinking threat? Look up, look down, look left, look right. Look all around. Julia Jones, today's update. After numerous demands, Marsha Waits finally called a public meeting to address the rumors that have been circulating on Sevastopol. But instead of the answers we wanted, he continued to be evasive, and after only a few minutes, he and his team were pelted by projectiles from an angry crowd. A gun was fired, there was panic, and now Waits and what's left of his team are forcibly ejecting us from the terminal. Feels like we're on our own now. So, people gonna die? Probably. Definitely. Yeah. Let's just go through this invisible wall. Still can't friggin' jump. I guess you can't jump in horror games. Ha <laughs> ha. Let's play the arcade games. Go a little bit gameception with this game. Yeah? Yeah? No? Okay. In your Seeks and Brand games. Run around Rex. What the freaking game is dead. Freaking spaceman running around. With this horseshoe mustache. Or no, it's not horseshoe. What am I thinking? Hmm, I need to go somewhere. But where, I do not know. Because it's not clearly pointed out to me, thankfully. I mean, I could use this door here if it wasn't for the invisible wall. Ah. <sighs> 
I'm seeing what you're typing in there. Handlebar, thank you. Well, I'm looking. There doesn't seem to be a way out of here. Thank you for your commentary, chat. Okay, I'll go back to the other little spot to see what I can find. I mean, I can't go through here, apparently. Tight little space, I can't just walk through normally. I can't just squeeze through like a sidestep. No. Can't do that. You run very loudly. That is great for a horror game. Yeah. Trying to find she isn't it and not seeing nothing. Oh, excuse me. I need to use that. Ooh. That's not what I was thinking, what I wanted to do. I didn't realize I couldn't pick it back up. Ooh. Waste of a good flare. Does this door work? No. 42, thanks, baggage claim. Well, I can't do anything here. Floor door in the restaurant. Floor door, I'm not seeing the floor door. Oh! Thank you there, Doctor. Spookalicious. Oh. Is there something there? No. Why are you using incandescent bulbs in this point in the future? Did... was it... Is the Alien Universe just pretty much the 80s if it just decided to stay the 80s and only advance and keep the stinking aesthetic? I hope that's LED. I hope that's frickin' LED and frickin' environmentally safe and wise and stuff. I'm good with words. I know it. We would like to visit Japan at some point, yeah, definitely. They're nostalgia bulbs there, Skippy. Okay. This whole damn place is falling apart. You don't say. I mean, you can't exactly jump on this and go up there and go anywhere else. Creative. Oh dear. I have been blocked from a path that I can jump over. And, ooh, that jumping is gonna frickin' tick me the heck off. I'm trying not to swear so much because YouTube's a little bit nuts about swearing a lot. I can't go through here either. What the heck is this? What the heck? What the heck? What the frickin' heck? Alright, now I gotta look on the floors and the frickin' ceilings. I mean, in Outlast, I had to look up for vents and stuff and jump up there. And I have to look at the dang floor all the time to try and find any other uh, fancy ways out. I 
can I just scoot like right in here? Oh. Freaking thing. So you can't jump, but you'll crawl through the thing. I mean, I couldn't have just jumped over that freaking wheel looking thing over there. Oh, hey, a gap that's apparently wide enough for me to walk through. Yes, just cough at the dust because it's environmental. Whoa! What was that? What was that? I did not see what that was. That was actually a bit of a good jump scare, but it didn't make me too scared. Because it's gone now! They don't put you in that quickly, apparently. They don't put you in the fire that fast. Gotta wait for the water to boil first. And then they throw you in. Because that's cannibal soup. I can say that in this kind of stream, right? I mean, we're not already in the idea... We're not going without the idea that chest bursters are still around. Aren't. I think I messed up my negatives. I hate when I do that. I wish this would have been a left click or something because my left hand is not fast at pressing buttons. I can just like really go fast with my right hand. But my left hand, not so much. And some of you might be taking that the wrong way. You did, not me. Jeez, I can't just walk it up this way. Hey, is anyone there? Hey, somebody's dead. Well, how did they go? Iron torch required. Oh, so I get to do some welding. I'm a machinist and I can do some welding apparently now. A machinist who plans to be an engineer. Plasma torch. Uh, great, I need freaking two different kinds of flames. But how will I find out? Ooh, spooky. It's almost like something could pop out from behind this door. So, I guess no flashlights permitted. No. Okie dokie, I'm kind of stuck again, but I'm going to try and figure it out. Hmm. Is there anything in the baggage claim that I can claim? What, I can't just rummage through people's luggage? Oh, come on. There's got to be something good in there to get. I mean, this is kind of a survival horror. You kind of need those things, especially if you're crafting. I mean, seriously. Maintenance jack required. So, I need all these different fancy keys for these doors. Isn't that a little bit old school? Find the key. Find the torch. Open the door. Tomato, tomato. Yeah, apparently no one wants me to rummage through the luggage. They don't want to be ransacked. Hey, that looks like a machining table. And there are things in there. Oh yeah, you can't jump through what looks like an open window.
Well, let's see where this goes in the opposite direction. Oh, nice. Oh, hey, are these all body bags? I think I went a different way. No, I went this way. I know where I'm at. Spooky space country. Okay. That's gotta be the exit up ahead. Or spooky space slide guitar. Sounds like a slide guitar almost. Ew, my god, your face. That's a little spooky looking. Fuck the marshals. Got it. Ah, now I know where your head is at. Hoi, hoi, hoi. Whose machine just farted? Oh, hey, we get to hide in lockers again. Well, I think we can probably save here and be okay. Oh, good God. There is something here. Yay, another hallway. Anything I can find out in this room of fancy tube monitors? So this is just a nostalgic future. Got it. Reverse, it's Turner. Got to deal with that wasted asshole again. This time he nearly wrecked the door with a maintenance jack. Guess he figures it's safe here. He wants to lock himself in. Screw him. Break in. Oh. Threw him in the lock. Oh, what's over here? Oh, great. A big fancy room. A little fancy room. Waits. Lied to us. Nice. Well, there's nothing in here, apparently. Let's go to the... Excuse you, I was trying to exit. Good God. I seriously. Well, time to see what's in this big... <sighs> Hey, another tape recorder. I guess we can use these as distractions. Oh, okay. So I can't just while I go in by crouching. I have to activate my entrance. Uh. Is there going to be anything in the vent this time? Let's see. Hey, made it. Hello, I want to make a complaint to the, the highest authority, okay? My name is Zachary Watson. That's Watson. You get that? My complaint is this. The fucking marshals. They should be protecting us. It's their job. Something's on this station with us and no one knows what it is. No one fucking knows. Put braces on the doors. Locked down. You know, like to keep something out. I'm fucking terrified, man. I'm fucking. Shit. It's so cold. I don't think this fucking thing even works. 
Effect ID tag. Oh. So I get to collect the IDs of the deceased. Well, that'll be great for the press and the executives. This maintenance jack looks like a weapon. Hmm. So how do I... Oh, right. I use the thing. Oh god, I hear mangle again. Hold the right mouse button and left mouse button? Okay. Press A. Okay. That's a little bit ridiculous, but fine. What the heck? Did I miss something? Yay, I can open doors! So what is of importance in here? Oh! Interview subject. Heist. Did I say that right? Heist? Look, if you can't even tell me your name, we're gonna be here a hell of a long time. I just wanna know about your boss. He's got you all into a lot of trouble. Someone's gonna be accountable. I'm gonna make damn sure someone's accountable. Well, I get some close sound. Tough guy, huh? Turner, turn off the tape. Maybe our friend here is just shy. Okie dokie. We are learning a little bit more, little by little. Oh, sound effects. Is there something with me? I don't know. We will certainly find out. I mean, eventually I'm going to be a little bit paranoid at some point, right? When does the danger happen? Where's the danger? Can't be freaking Mr. White. Freaking Walter White. Oh, dynamic. Stay still. Okay. Okay. Ripley. Where'd you come from? Ripley. Off station. A ship. There's no ships here. There are now. Well, huh, that's good news. Because things are not so good here. Something blue just now. Rocked this whole place. I saw it. But lady, that's the least of our problems. Yeah? Yeah. Something's on this station. There's an Irishman in space. Something you wouldn't believe. Like what? A killer. You get it? Okay. Okay. Stare blankly in the space. Got it. What's your name? Axel. I was boarding with two colleagues. EVA. We got separated by the blast. Can you help me find them? Because you seem to know your way around. No, I mean, why? What's in it for me? A place on the ship. How did I know I can trust you? I need to find comms. I need to contact my ship. This is your lucky day. 
Let's go, sweetheart. Seek some comms is in the Sistex bio. It's quite a distance, but we can get to a transit through the freight area. But watch yourself. We can get into all sorts of trouble there, okay? Oh, great. Come on, I don't want to stick around here long. Working on it, jeez. Was that you following me back there? I had to keep my distance. Can't take any chances. Those doors are wide open. Is there something in there? Oh, there is. I just blindly explore, not waste a flare. Inquisitive type, eh? Stick close to me. What? Hey, don't move. Oh, oh, okay, okay. We're not looking for trouble. Who are you? I'm John. This is Ringo. They're just some assholes. We haven't got time for this. Come on, Jana. We're trying to get to comms. Can you help us? We don't Beatles need joke. their help. Don't tell them anything. Look, I've got the elevator working. Jana, let's go, okay? I... I'm sorry. Good luck. Don't die. What the hell was that about? Why are you so damn aggressive? Everyone's running shit scared. Keeping it to their own. Safer that way. Yay for blind exploration. So apparently I can't run when I have this guy around. Got it. Yeah, tomorrow, keep out, blah blah blah. I hope this ship of yours is the real McCoy. Hold up. Let me get the elevator. Let me save the game first in case you die. Allow me. Place is old. Needs a special touch. Sure. Well, what are you waiting for? Hit the button. Let's go to freight shipping. Keep the noise down here. There might be people around. I'd appreciate it if you told me what the hell was going on right now. Listen, down. Sudden angry stance. When we get to the ship, we can kick back, braid each other's hair, and chat all you want. Yeah, when we get to my ship, I need to know what's going on right fucking now. Like I said, there's a killer. A killer? What does that even mean? I ain't seen it, but it's here. Picking us off one by one. What are you saying? A psycho? A person? No, something else. A monster. Oh yeah, it's gonna be spooky, isn't it? So very spooky. Control. Shit. We need to move. This way. Get down. This is bullshit, man. You should be looking for a way off. Are you crazy? There's no way off. At least we're safe down here. For how long? What if they come for us? Then we shoot the crap out of them. Now shut up. You're making me nervous. Ah, wonderful humans. Trouble. We'll have to go around them. Follow me. Oh, jeez. Let me lead the way. Got it. Hello? Can I get in there? There we go. Friends of yours? I've had run-ins with those guys before. They don't like strangers. Even nice guys like me. I'm shocked. I prune your chain, darling. You want to go and say hello? It's your funeral. Those guns aren't for show. Someone should be doing something. They are. It's called surviving. Ha! <laughs> Survival horror. Called it. Everyone's turning on each other. The fear. It makes people crazy. I've noticed. You 
you've been living here? What can I say? My butler's on holiday. Grab what you need. You don't know when you'll get another chance. Oh, I can't exactly. Oh, here we go. Been hunkered down here for a week now, waiting for a ship. Waiting for you, I guess. It can get pretty dark around here. You should take that flashlight over there. Hey, I do get a flashlight. The headset flashlight. Nice. Dramatic headset music. Just be careful not to flash it around. We don't want to get caught. Let's go. This way. I just collected the batteries, though. Oh, I guess I can access that standing. No, you fuck. Oh. I love the vent. There's another vent right here somewhere. I'm out to show you to forget it. How about you look around? You're not going anywhere until you find that vent. Yeah, find the vent. Got it. Looks like this, doesn't it? Yeah, thank you for the reference there, Skippy. Axel, is this it? Hold on. I'm coming. I knew it was here somewhere. See? Got it covered. I'm trying to do the thing. I'll get in there when you stop clanking around. It's not smart to stay here too long. Right. Is the way everyone travels around here? Just those who want to stay alive, sweetheart. Torrent, so that's your ship, huh? Quiet. I hear something. Yeah, I hear you. Will do. Gotta go meet the others. Something's going down. There's always something going down. Come on. We don't want to piss him off. <coughs> Follow me. I'm following. I just save real quick. Okay, go be quiet here. Don't shine that flashlight. I, I can't. I need to reload it. Quietly. Still think we need more supplies, guns, food, wherever we can find it. Oh, I have to hold the F button. Got it. Hold up. What's the emergency? Someone else has been here. Everyone, stay alert. Keep your guns tight. Shoot anyone you don't know. Stick around while I check our stock. You feel safe? We sure as hell don't. Yeah, I'm too many of them to take on. Take on? We still got to get through there. The door at the end. Oh. Distraction. The generator. If that went down, they'd have to check it out. You're smaller than me. You'll make less noise. Great. Which one of you checked our supplies last? I did. What's up? You decide to help yourself a little? What the fuck is that supposed to mean? Yeah, let's just kind of sneak around. 
We're missing food, ammo, meds. If it's not one of us, then we were right. Someone's been in here. This is no good. We're supposed to be secure down here. Damn it. What about the lock Joe rigged up? I've just come from there. Sealed tight. Let's I mess around with the generator. The guns ready. Someone's gonna have to tell the boss. Boss? He's a goddamn store clerk. Yeah? Maybe you think you could do better. He's not saying that. I'm just saying that I'm trying to listen. Just stop saying. Help me check the rest of this stuff. That is, if you could keep your trap from running for five seconds. Sneak on by. Wait. I think this is kind of a bad place. Oh yeah, that's a bad spot. I can't believe you left me alone back there. Is there anyone here? I hope not. Can I start this? Yes. No. Maybe so. There we go. It just turned itself off? No. Somebody's here. Check it out. Make it everyone with me. Who's there? Come out. Doesn't seem to be broken. How would you know, Einstein? If the generator had blown, there'd be smoke. Well, it's not working now. Nice work. Even a safety got tripped. This way. Could have been a road. Got stuck. Follow me. Set off the safety. Let's keep it down. They're still close by. Yay! Made it. Nailed it. Let us just casually save again. And we're okay. Let's go down through the hallway. Hey. Not quite what you're expecting, eh? I'm not even supposed to be here. My shipping out papers were for a week ago. Uh, let me access the terminal, sir. I want to see what's on Sevasta Link. I want to learn a little bit. A blind eye. Yes. I managed to get my hands on that stuff I was talking about. Chief won't even notice the stock missing. Things always get lost when the station's closing down. Don't worry about customs either. Sinclair's told his men to turn a blind eye. They'd probably be too busy goofing off or ta taking backhanders to notice anyway. You get what you pay for, I guess. Bailey. Oh, give me a sec. Two-man rule. Nearson, Leonard, you're both first shift on the door, so read carefully. Putting this together wasn't easy, and we don't want intruders getting in because you didn't read the instructions properly. This here is what you call a two-man rule lock. This means it needs two m to open the door simultaneously from two different consoles. Most of us don't know each other, so this is the safest way of making sure everything stays secure and of us decide to head off on their own with our stuff. When you're on shift, take it in turns to keep guard and notify the other if one of us needs to be let in or out. This means just us no one else no matter how much anyone begs and no matter what sob story they try and pull i was with a group before and we got soft and now i'm the only one left trust new one joe let's check inventory inventory no one is taking anything or mark it off the list without talking to me first aspirin times four Canned food, 32 cereals, 6 boxes, water, 4 gallons, toothpaste, 
12 tubes, cigarettes, 3 cartons, toilet paper, 26 rolls, industrial tape, 6 rolls, med kits, 2, powdered milk, times 52. Wow, you guys got a lot of milk. Notes. Running low on ammunition. Zoe managed to pick up some prescription drugs, all addressed to the same person. Yes, they didn't need them anymore. <clears throat> Yay. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Oh, gotta restore power. The assholes have cut us off. Hey. Got it. We need to activate both consoles at the same time to open it. I'll do this one. You go to the one on the other side. Okay. Oh, man. I have to go all the way back here. Ready. On three. One, two. Oh, it's automatic. Three. You waited for me? Behind you. Son of a bitch! You bums think you can take what you want? Get the fuck off me! Now you picked the wrong guy. Oh, nice. Anyone else with you? Huh? Oh, that was necessary. On way. Five shots left, I guess, if you're going at the we max. Go. No! Hey, you bastards! Move it! Oh, nice. Running Shit. time! Shit, I think he's dead. They killed him. Come on! Cutscene time. Good. You killed Drink break. Guy because he was going to kill me, you saved my life. This is about survival. Understand. Hear something. I hear something. Axel. Look if I go on me. Oh. Spookalicious. What the hell was that thing? Yeah, good job keeping it pretty unseen. Oh, that's the wrong way. So I was safe regardless. Look through here? No. Call transit. Okay. Well, let's call. Hello. I need a ride. Oh. It's nearby. But where is it? Oh good god, I forgot I have to look on the ceilings. Because they can be from anywhere. Open the door! I need to leave, like now! Can you let me through the frickin' door? E to Lauren Sistek Spire. Welcome to Sevastopol. Achievement unlocked. Some doors have been secured with security braces. Use the maintenance jack to, to release blah blah blah. The more you can collect and build, the more options you will have. 
Never give me these tips on good timing, do ya? Find an elevator so to seek the communication. So when do I get a health pack? Made this face because of the music. Yeah, thanks to Nostalgia Future. Is there anything of interest over here? Let us see. Yeah, let's go in here. Oh, security access tuner required. Got it. Did I hear a little something something? Oh, these things beeped. I guess. Oh, I get to search dead bodies. That's nice. Oh, hey, a med kit. Oh, I have to build a medikit. Oh, that's interesting. And a bonding agent. Let's commit. Oh, let's click here to craft the item. Build to survive. Great. But I don't think I need to cure myself quite yet. Although that might actually help. Oh, I get to use this as a melee weapon. Perfect. That's going to be annoying to remember. Okay. I hear something. It sounds like a really cheap android. Well, I can probably save. Two. One. There we go. Ooh, without thought of the goofy idea of making the freaking load time for a save terminal. Plasma torch. Yeah, yeah. I know. Oh, hey. We can get somewhere. Maybe. Possibly. Did I come from this way? I don't think I did. Take the it up to seek some communications. No weapons allowed. Oh, that's my only way. Oh, maybe not. Let's go. Quietly. Oh, that didn't even do anything for me. Shit. Let me climb in. She's in the vents.
trying to listen closely. There's got to be a way to access this little area. Damn. I hope they left the area. Trying to look around. Am I safe? Well, I guess I'm as safe as I'll ever be. Data cell. She was right here. Maybe she was just scavenging like us. Do you really want to take that chance? Okay. We find the teller. Did anyone else catch that? Pretty crap. Oh, shizzle bizzle. Oh, good, I got a little safe room. And take the items. Ooh, revolver ammo. I get to fight back now. <laughs> Is that the plan? Do I get to get a gun? Oh yeah, I can't jump. But I can climb. Apparently. Oh no. Yeah, I can't exactly go out there at the moment. Okay. Ugh, all this dust. Ooh, is there someone to my left? Gotta move. Oh, frick. Where's the thing? There it is. You did not see that? You did not just see that? Are you serious? You were looking my direction there, buddy, and you did not see that. You did not see the vent, or hear the vent, audibly and visually opening and closing. Okay. I guess. I guess we have to move on. I guess we'll be fine. You still didn't see me? Seriously? Well, how about you move? gone. Can I go this way?
Oh, man. Ah, uh, crap. Open. Let me in. Well, that bites. You can't find me here. Oh, I gotta wait for the fancy chase music to end. Oh, well, gee, thanks. Hmm, now I figure out getting around these guys. That's the challenge. Dang, sneak challenges. Where the hell did he go? Oh, crap. You guys don't leave, do you? Got to hydrate with delicious water. for repeated lines. Loud frickin' noise and you're not hearing it. Excuse me. Oh, jeez, didn't see him. Go back? You mean back to the other area? But I don't I don't get that I miss something with this. I need a plasma torch. Oops, wrong little thing. I can't access the door without a plasma torch. I don't see a plasma torch.
Oh, crap. Your shoes are so freaking loud. Good lord. This is some bullshit. Oh crap. Hey, over there. Oh, come on. Some tags are susceptible to physical attacks when they are stunned. Blow the current save. Avoid making fart noises. Got it. Okay, already got him all searched. Maybe now I can actually understand this. Use rewire to toggle systems on and off in your surrounding area. Systems have a limited power supply. Switching systems off will provide the power to switch others on. Study the map on the right hand screen with mouse to check the position of local systems. Access new areas, create divi diversions, and experiment with Sevastopol's systems to help achieve your goal. Oh, geez. Well, I think that's all I can do for here. Hmm. I don't need to go to the engineer index quite yet. Was it this way? Yep. And there's something over here. Nope. Jump! Get up! Get up! Get up! Get up! Get up! Get up! You stink! Get up! Why do you not run when I press shift when you're crouching? God dang, that's so freaking inconvenient. So, I'll go back to that safe room real quick. Can't go through there. You go through here? Nope. Take all those items. Ray, listen to me very carefully. 
I want you to leave work now. Collect Claire, pick up the cat, and head home. We need to find some place safe till Seeks and send a ship. I saw the guy from down the hall. Yeah, I can't remember his name, but one in the dirty baseball cap, weird smell. He had something in his coat. I think it was a gun. He just looked right through me. Don't talk to anyone. Don't tell them where you're going. I'll meet you as soon as I can. Let's rewire something while they're away. I'm totally cheating the game a little bit. Hmm. I guess I can't really do anything here since everything seems activated. Gotta explore real quick. Just gotta cheat this thing a little bit. Hey, move. God dang. So frickin' inconvenient. When a thing doesn't operate like you want it to. My only complaint for this game is slight clunkiness for the controls. Oh hey, you got the she's in the vent achieve she's in the vents achievement. Alright, let's get those couple of things here. Take that from here. Yeah, I need the plasma torch for that. So, don't you love being in the moment when you're kind of stuck in a loop? I'm trying to really see where I need to go. Nice texture. You're some nice fellas. I'm in the shadows. You can't see me. I am hidden from everybody. Yeah, because booze is important. Can you scoot along there, buddy? Oh. You're on the prowl, aren't you? Oh, you actually can get up from a crouch. Oh, damn it. Found a way out, I think. Let's try that again.
Did I take the right way? No, I did not. Checked you, yes. Now let me through, please. Get up from that damn crouch, you damn frickin' fool! You guys run quickly. Okay, just making sure. Okay, there's no way up there from that way. Got it. Oh, I thought that was an open door. <sighs> Where is the way out? There must be a way out, I'm sure of it. I mean, I have to find some way to get around these guys, right? At this rate, the stream is gonna be finishing with me stuck in this area. I swear to God. Where do I go? Oh, right. Oh, man, really? There we go. Blah, 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 I know. Oh shit! That's where they came from. I was wondering where they went. Come on. Damn, that sucks. God, I can't keep doing this. Can we stop now? I can't see any sign. You there with your fancy baseball cap and shizn it. We 
I'm guessing the encounter music kind of means that they're still on alert. Clear. I don't know their patrol patterns yet. Okay, let's give this a try. Hopefully I'll survive! I need to get through. Gotta run. I think she went downstairs. Come on. Gotta keep running. Uh, I'm not going down there. No way. Oh, great. I guess we're okay. Nearly dead, but I'm okay. Well, the challenge is going to be surviving. As it always has been. I mean, I can make another med kit, but let's see how long I last. I'm sure I'll do okay. Oh, dang it. Oh, hello. Let's take the vent route, since that's always a popular option. Is this to... Nah, that's nah, not to do anything. Okay, now I guess I have to make the uh, med kit. Or not. Hmm...
I guess they can't create a flare. I mean, that would be kind of cool, but I guess I can't. Oh, but oh, gotta find a way through. Well, for a game that's supposed to be a little bit spooky, it's not exactly too spooky right now. I mean, he had a little surprise from the alien, but where's the impending doom? I really need to access that place. Let's check the office. Tech support HQ, whatever. Low power. God dang it. Oh, hey. Oh, so right, right mouse button allows me to aim. Mm. Yeah, let's just save anyways. So fast for the future. Maybe if I look upstairs, I'll find something. Oh, hello. Oh. I can't speed crawl. Okay. This flashlight goes through batteries like water. Jeez. Batteries never frickin' last in horror genres. That's like a rule, I think, or something. Oh, there's the camera. Okay, this is where I started, and I can't get anything. I'm sure I'll figure this one out, too. Like with everything else. There's always something I'm not seeing somewhere. Nope. Oh. Well, that's kind of cool. Access said the system, SysTech Spire houses seeks and communications. Find a way to get in there. Well, I. Huh. Excuse me, I'm still getting used to my new work shift. Not used to waking up in the morning. Waking up in the morning. <sighs> Words. Oh jeez, that made me jump for a moment in my, at least in my head, because I thought someone was in there, but it was only a freaking bird. 
I see you bobbing. I see you bobbing with your imaginary glass of water that's not even there. Friggin' bobbing woodpecker thing. I don't know what bird it is. I don't know what bird it's based on. It just looks like a freaking woodpecker when I see that freaking pointed beak. Excuse me. Let me see what I need to see. Let me find what I... Find what I need to find. Let me just check the vent one more time, just in case. Oh, that's nothing. God dang it. Let's hide for a second. All the post-its are the same. Uh, where do I find the power? Key card required. Gee, you gotta send that. Oh wait, it did. Hey, key card. Eh. I'll make a med kit real quick. Okay, get one of those and those. Let's craft. Ah, uh, come on. Gotta save and be sure. Be safe. Alright. Stay safe, Tammy, even though I know it's fuel. Access granted. There's something in here with me. Ooh. ID tag. It's almost like it's a collectible. Take this, take that, take this and that and this and that. Hold on, not yet. System monitoring. Oh god. Searching. Oh, the alien. Can I make one? Apparently I can. A non-harmful device which detonates on impact, stunning nearby humans and build blinding humans, and synthetic look synthetic synthetics looking at uh, detonation. As a modified proximity device, it can be placed as a trap that will trigger when enemies near. Ooh, versatile. It lo looks a little bit retro, like everything else. <laughs> oh God. The flight recorder. What? What? No. God.
No, oh, you got a character that can be emotional. Where do I go? Where do I go? Where in the world do I go? There's gotta be something I need to see. Okay, apparently this isn't my way out. Data cell. Let's try this thing out. Turn the code, system with mouse, and move keys, and use move keys and E to enter the code shown. Um, oh crap. Oh, jeez. That's what I needed to do. Okay. Now there's a little bit of a sense of impending danger. Oh, great. One way out. Let me get a signal. Oh, crap. Got it. Freaking retro devices. Retro future. Sevastolin, give me some information real quick, okay? Archives. To W. Chief Porter, Sevastopol Terminals. Chief, the good news is that I'm about 80% through archiving Sevastopol's inter internal mail system for the decommissioning. It's been de discontent. My goodness, words. Disconnected from Apollo. But I've left the basic messaging system in place for the people still here. The bad news is whoever set it up in the first place skimped on the hardwire and hardware, and we've had some leaks. I've got Mike Tanaka looking into it now. He's a, the, the specialist archivist we called in. We called in. Seems to know his shit. Just thought I'd better give you the heads up in the meantime, Franco. An outpost of progress. Let's see. Sevastopol, an outpost of progress by Julia Jones. Desolation through isolation. <laughs> well, that's kind of the name of the game. The space station that nobody needed, run by a company we all forgot. Sevastopol is, the, is now a backwater. Excuse me. The population is a tenth of the station's optimal capacity. Docking bays are empty and the shutters are down on local stores and businesses. The orders for Seekson's cheaply manufactured androids have long since dried up and the antiquated Apollo governing AI system frequently malfunctions. How did we how did we get here? And more importantly, where have billions of dollars of investment gone? My name is Julia Jones. I have lived on Sevastopol for two months compiling this report for the Colonial Times, discovering the price our second tier corporations have paid for their oven over expansion during the race into the outer rim. 
Don't you love when there's systems and corporations? Well, there's nothing here, I guess. Time to go through the spookiness. Just a little bit further. And then something happens. Oh wait, gotta get something. Um. Oh, only got eight bullets. Better make them count. Okie dokie. Ah, uh, no elevator access. Got it. Break the lock. And do this. Okay, I think we can survive now. Maybe. Oh. I let myself into a loop. Hmm. Can't do anything here. But can I do anything here? No, I cannot. I just let myself in a circle. Oh, that is fantastic. <sighs> that did me a lot of good. Um, can I change anything here? Oh, here we go. Press enter? Really? Oh, no. So much tension. I'd probably say don't go in the vents. Let's kind of run away. Hopefully that group won't be around to shoot me. Um... Uh, what the... Ah, shizzle! Let me through. Oh, nice. Oh, God. No, 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 nobody in Opison. Oh, crap. Well. That's good. It not. So now I probably have to... All the way back here? Uh. Let's search this. Take some of that. Oh, God. 
Oh yeah. And let's get what's in here. And in here. Can we skip this? I'm sorry, but can we skip this? No, we cannot. What? No. God. Okay. Okay. Stay focused. Come on. Well, Alien One, Jester Zero. Got it. Oh, hey, scrap. Oh, was that something? Smoke bomb. Now let's go back the other way. Go back to here. Let's save again real quick, just in case. So, over two and a half hours in, we finally get the alien. Disable the security lockdown. Uh, let's see. Red you, but I might need to go through you again just because of whatever reason. Blah, 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 blah. No offense, but just in case the game decides it's not counted unless I go through it again. this again. And the alien approacheth. It just disappeared. 
I just freaking disappeared. Now let us just save one more time. Okie dokie. Now that we're clear of that, we can run upstairs and try to escape the alien. Oh god! So it, it's, I guess it's an interactive scene. That's nice. Well, time to run upstairs again and try and figure out how to get around this alien. Or Xenomorph, as we may specify. But it's kind of nice, they give you a couple of different death scenes depending on which way you're facing. Um. Kind of convenient that the codes are right there. No, 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 Oh, god dang it. So, oh. Crap. So, the alien, the xenomorph, likes to camp. Xeno, Zeno, I'm not sure which it is. Oop, sorry, I gotta fix the, allow an, a modded message. Okay, resume. That's only one. What could go wrong? Oh, I don't know. Tons of things. Okay, gotta make it through this door. Let me in, let me in. Let me out, let me out, let me out, rather. Okie dokie, you press nothing. A hunt begins. Why, yes it does. Now, we are finally involved in the hunt. 
with the idea that are we hunting or are we the hunted? Hello, my name's Ripley, Amanda Ripley. I need your help. Please take a seat. Someone will be with you shortly. No wonder Seatson is losing the tech race. Great. A very cheap looking android. You know who makes better androids? The Red Ribbon Army. For those of you who don't know about the Red Ribbon Army, watch Dragon Ball. And Dragon Ball Z. Since they're... Dragon Ball Z has less involvement from the Red Ribbon Army, but still has a little bit of them. Control. It's urgent. That is a restricted area. It's an emergency. Don't you realize what's going on? Apollo has the situation in hand. Your registration is almost complete. Forget it. I'll find my own way in. What helpful androids. What did you say to me? What did you sass me with? Ooh, don't you give me that sass. I will slap you so hard. Okie dokie. Ethanol. Motion tracker. Some kind of tracker. It's been modified. I wonder. No, no problem. Let's access this terminal and read up on the history. Door override. Hughes, I've put a manual lock on the door leading upstairs. Don't want any accidents until we figure out what's going on here. Chief. Whoops. IO error. Okay. Our manifesto, first published on Eye of Seekson, February 2115. We don't want to show you a new world, we want to discover it with you. Here at Seekson, every new technology, research project, and discovery is driven to find real-world applications to help you. We hope to, you'll join us for the journey. Tomorrow, together. Oh, now that graffiti is making more sense. Together tomorrow, Siegson's journey into colonial space, an official history by Sebastian Sieg, first printed in Eye on Siegson. Our Origins in Space, 2034. Wow, that's coming up soon. It changed everything. The advent of faster than light travel put Siegson, then known as Siegen's son, uh, on the path to success. The race into space began in earnest and under the steady hand of our founder, Josiah Sieg. Our company ha was primed and ready for the years that followed. Sieg and Son built the components that enabled ships to extend colonial space beyond the solar system. As history relates, Wayland Corp was reluctant to share its FTL technologies with other corporations. Fortunately, Josiah Sieg was on the heart hand to speculate, innovate, and produce. Without Sieg and Son, the skies would have looked very different indeed. Wow, that's corporate grade cheesy. Something you'd expect from an 80s series. Please understand. Marie, if you get this, I'm making my way to Seeks and Communications now. I didn't wake you because I knew you'd try and stop me. Please understand, this is our best shot. Someone has got to reestablish communications. We need to make sure the officials back at home know what's going on here. Don't worry about me. I'll be back. I'm not going to leave you in clear mind. Oh boy. 
door access over a door mechanism. Season. Hmm. Yeah, I'll worry about that when it comes to be important. Oh, hey. Human employee recreation. Hey, let's save. Oh, lordy. Oh, there we go. Now we got some light. Human employee recreation. Working on the edge of motion tracker screen points to your objective. Oh, okay. I'll go there in a moment. Here we go. Getting used to knowing how to operate this. This is a very, oh, not so tiny room. I like when I find surprises. It's bigger on the inside. Well, so much for human recreation. S. I like how it defocuses the background because you're focusing on the motion detector. Collect charge pack? Okay. I like a game that rewards you for exploring. Nope. Oh. Here we go! Glorious. Just plain glorious. Oh. Hold on. Let me access my menu. Hmm. Could use another med kit. And. Let's see about him. Flashbang? How about a smoke bomb? Oh, that's what needs the ethanol. As a modified proximity device. Ooh, nice. Also got motion sensing. Well, within range. Hmm. Um... Let me just check what was in the case again. Sensor, okay. That didn't need it. That needed a sensor. So... Do I still have a flashbang? No, I don't. Let's commit! And now I'll take all of that. Whoops. You are entering a restricted area. Goodness. Let me in. I need to contact my ship. I'm sorry. I can't allow that. Ripley, Amanda. You have now been locked with our mother. Welcome to Sevastopol. There's gotta be another way inside. 
Well. Oh, key card. Oh, boy. Hmm. Don't give me that look. Well, since that's about the end of stream time, I should save real quick before I give my farewell and thank you to all of you who have watched. So, as we save, let me say to you, Thank you very much for watching. I am still Jester Day Rama, being as silly and nerdy as I am, you know. I'm just kind of that kind of guy. Um, but yes, you know what I always say at the end of this, other than, you know, praise the spurple. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, no matter the time of day. Love you lots. I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for watching.